There's the a UK. real paradox going on right now because everybody's talking about being healthy, the wellness economy being 3.7 trillion, nobody wanting to use the word diet, but the problem is nobody is getting healthier, we're getting unhealthier. And the numbers are staggering and we really want to help solve that paradox. And I get asked all the time who our competition is and the reality is our competition is people trying to get healthy themselves. Only about 5% of people use a commercial weight loss program. I want to focus on the 95%. Somehow, and so what we're doing yeah. is really trying to educate people, partner with people, and inspire people to have healthy habits to live a healthier life. What they put in their body, how they move their body, and how they think. And that's... Dieting, I'm, I'm always hungry. And, and, and knowing now that somehow it's made it all the way to, to my wife who told me that hard-boiled eggs are zero points. Right. That appeals to me a lot because I could eat too many, probably. <laughs> you say that nobody can eat too many hard-boiled but just knowing that, or chicken breast, to know that I could eat yeah. enough chicken breast where, I'm the, where I don't have that feeling like I wish I had. So freestyle. That's a great idea. So what's it called? Freestyle, it's a new freestyle. which is the new program. It's been the most successful and the most efficacious of any program we've had. So what it really does, and there's tremendous science behind this, there's about 200 foods that have zero points. And we measure them not just on calories, calories, nutrients, fats, sugars, like and satiety, yeah. for example. Uh -huh. right. so, and so, yeah. then you get a certain amount of points. But it's very easy and it's livable. What I love about our program in general is it fits into your life. There's no prescribed foods that you have to eat. You can be with your family. You can go out. It just teaches you to make the healthy choices. I want to know those foods. And, and knowing that you can, I mean, that's a, an empowering yeah. feeling to Think know you can eat it. something all and have it zero. All fish, and have all zero. seafood, all real okay. chicken, what happened to the idea? Corn. You saw these studies that came out just about a week and a half ago that said, it, uh, people used to think it was calories in, calories out, right? Mm -hmm. But now it's, it's not really calories in, calories what, out at all? What, it's fascinating because you could take three 300-calorie plates and one would be two Weight Watchers points, one would be six, and what would be seven. So it measures it on a much more holistic point of view of how your body is going to process, right. how it's going to fill you up, and that's why it's so Talk effective. Talk about the peer pressure of all of this in terms of what actually gets people to, to do it properly. Dick Costello, I don't know if you saw this, well, uh, former, t former Twitter right. uh, CEO, started a new company, which then ended just yesterday, right. he was trying to do an exercise thing, uh, get people together. And he said we, it wasn't working because we realized that actually people just drop out of these programs between four and eight weeks later unless they're doing it in concert together in person, not just online. No, I cannot. And that they have some goal, like they need to actually either like uh, go into a race or that they're trying to diet for a wedding or that there's actually like a yeah. date. So what so. that talks to is the power of community. So when Weight Watchers first started in 1963, it started with an incredible food program and community in G. Knight's kitchen. That has not changed today. It's not in the kitchen, necessarily, but you look at the power of community. So every one of our members has the app. Right. You know, it's a mobile first company business. It's with you all the time. So you are basically have in the app Connect, which is our community platform. Then you also have the physical community of meetings. And in the future, there'll be more opportunities we have WW Cruise, for example, Week of Health and Wellness on the Sea. We have, you mentioned DJ Khaled yeah. um, and what we're going to be doing and bringing his community together okay. and Oprah being her community together. It is basically a combination of not just education, but inspiration that's really important. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.